What I have here is a piece of 1 8 inch thick mild steel. And I've got a thin piece of ductwork actually, and I've sanded a little bit on both sides. And I'm going to try to see if this will weld it together. In my drill press, I've got a driver bit that I ground on the end a little bit flat. So what I'm going to do first is I'm going to try to get it heated up on the thicker steel, and then I'm going to put the other metal in and try to weld them together. Okay, I'm going to try it again. I'm going to get it a lot hotter this time and then put it in and see what happens. <laughs> they stuck. I stalled out the drill press actually and that's actually welded right on there too. Um, I don't know how strong it is but you can see it's got some good penetration because it came right through the other side. Okay, taking it out, I can see that the sheet metal is not actually attached. It's kind of trapped with the uh, driver bit. And the driver bit did make a good connection there. It's not very strong, but then I didn't expect it to be. I've got a thicker piece of metal this time, this uh, fender washer. This is about uh, a little less than 1 16th of an inch thick. I'm going to use the hole to get the thing going. Now once again I stalled the drill press. I'm just going to try to snap that there. You can see that there's some connection but not a really good one. is stuck pretty good to that. Okay, that does have some comma, so it's changed to a smaller notch. I'm going to try it again. The wood burning up, filling up my workshop with smoke was unacceptable. So what I've done is I've taken a piece of insulated fire brick and I'm going to try that. Welded on there. Well, it's a lot harder to break this time. Just gonna pull this up. I just came out here to try this. You know, I was reading a lot of the comments, people saying friction welding, and there is definitely a similarity. Uh, it seems to have worked. It's not something that I want to rely on though, but it is possible with a drill press running at 3,000 RPMs to actually attach metal to metal. At least steel to steel.